Grandma, did you empty my wallet? Best thing I ever did. Okay. It's been, what, like, three minutes? Yeah. It's supposed to stick to the bread, isn't it? Yeah. I was just thinking about you. Hey, Judy. Uh, yeah, I'm actually really busy right now. I'm working on my resume. I'm trying to get it down from five pages to one page, which is actually very difficult. I have quite a few accomplishments and accolades, and abbreviating them is just is, is very, very hard. That sounds difficult. It is, and, and they won't even look at your application for a job if you don't have a resume with it, so it's really important, which is, um, which is sort of the reason I'm calling you. What did you say, Peter? That was very quiet. Can I borrow $50, Peter, I can't understand what you're saying. You, can you speak up, please? Judy, can I borrow $50? Why do you need to borrow $50? My grandmother took my cards away. What is up with her? She was being very weird all of a sudden, don't you think? Making you get a job and now stealing your cards from you? I don't know what's wrong with her. She seems to think I can't make any money as a writer. What I, I'm sure I could make a great living at it. You would be a good writer. I know. So... Do you think I could borrow $50? I don't know, Peter. My dad gave me a credit card, but it's for emergency situations only. Judy, this is an emergency. What is? Judy, I need to get my resume down from five pages to one, and I don't have any money. I still don't understand why you need the $50, Peter. Okay, Judy, there's this website online that, for a small fee, will edit your resume down from five pages to one. It's, it's something that, that I just, I can't do. I, a, a, anything else that I do to it, I feel like will be ruining the presentation of my accomplishments and my skills. And you're sure this is a good idea? How long was your resume before? Judy, I wouldn't be asking you about this if I didn't think it was a good idea. Now, are you going to give me the $50 or not? Because I, I don't have time to just sit here and talk about it with you. And you can do it yourself. Judy, if you would like to try it, you can. I have already spent many hours editing down from 15 pages to 5. So let's just leave it to the professional. It, they excel. It's, it's what they do. Uh, just a minute. Do you want me to just read you the numbers for my card now? Yes, that would be great. Okay. Nine, six, seven. Peter, this makes me feel weird. I think it's very strange for me to do this over the phone. Well, come over then. Okay, I'll be over in just a minute. Judy, I don't know. Well, I'm trying it with the spaces first. All right, that's fine. That's all you need? Yeah. Okay. You well, put it in? Yeah, it's in. Okay. Do you want to hang out or play some games or something? Because I move in five days, so. Oh, I really can't. I appreciate the money. And as soon as my grandma gives me my cards back, I'll, I'll pay. It's fine. Whatever.
has your little friend. Who? Judy? Because I haven't talked to Judy in a long time. Ignorance does not run on my side of the family, Peter. I heard you shut the door, and I heard the two of you talking on the porch. Yeah, well, Judy just got a lead on a new job, so... <laughs> You're a terrible liar. Oh, yeah, you got a job. Did the newspaper call back? No, Sandy called back. You got a job at the hardware store. Grandma, I'm not working at the hardware store. <laughs> you want to bet? <laughs>